Hey everyone, hey Smiles Ministry, community, family, Instagram family. Hope you're good. It's been so hot and nice the last few days here in the UK, um, which to me personally thinking it's not a coincidence that the, the three days of the Jewish New Year, um, the New Hebraic Year of 5782 um, is been so hot here but there you go the lord is definitely up to something but yeah happy rosh hashanah i wanted to come on and just share some words that the lord um holy spirit has been giving to me um i've just literally asked him i know a lot of people his sons and daughters have come before him and they said lord what are you saying in this new year um so i did the same and i kind of just read it we'll read it to you in bullet points because that's how i wrote it down um so i just want to pray because when i read this i want you to be able to take these words to the lord and just see if that's something that is for you for someone you know um or how you perceive it and take these revelations these um words of wisdom from the throne room before holy spirit and to just pray through them and with them so just father god i just pray for everyone under the sound of my voice that they may receive your word with open heart open mind open soul open spirit in the name of jesus christ and i just thank you for your word and how you're speaking to your sons and daughters in this rosh hashanah that you're pouring out revelation and new things as we've entered into this new hebraic year and as we're finishing up the last couple of months of 2021 and heading into 2020 to in this calendar that you will just bring forth your glory and we're so excited to see what you're doing in jesus name amen so these are bullet points and there is one two three four five six seven eight which is absolutely perfect and i did not plan it because today is um the evening of today of the 8th of september 2021 is when the feast of trumpets the celebrations of the hebraic new year is finishing eight biblically means new beginnings and the lord gave me eight revelations so number one the lord said light brings out darkness it cleanses blindness and it leads the path to righteousness number two the lord said more and more people will come face to face with the throne room number three the lord said my people will see crystal clear what i've been doing this past year and with that he gave me the scripture of revelations 21 11 which i'll post um in in the comment box in the description box underneath here number four the lord said the number 777, so triple seven, will cancel out any attempts made by 666. And biblically, as followers of Jesus Christ, we know what 666 represents. It's the mark of the beast. So he said that 777 will cancel out any attempts made by 666. Number five, the Lord said remorse will be written on people's heart for not listening earlier. And when I, when I first heard this, um it was it was i heard this um like filled and concealed in love so when he says remorse will be written on people's heart that is not coming with guilt that is not coming with condemnation because that's not what father god does but he holy spirit does convict us and the remorse for not listening earlier will be filled with conviction but also with love number six the lord said the cross has the final word and with that i heard a lion roaring in the spirit Number seven, the Lord said, humility is key. No matter what, whatever exposure comes, stay humble. And number eight, the Lord said, different viewpoints will arise amongst my people. What, but I will be, I being the Lord, I will be the voice of truth. Obey me and you will stay in line. So Father God, we thank you for these eight words of wisdom that you have released to me for your vessel, for your willing vessel. I'm, I'm nobody. I'm just here to serve you. And we just thank you that your sons and daughters will receive these new words and take them into the secret place to pray over and pray with. And I just pray that it blesses the people that will watch this video in Jesus name. So again, I wish you... Um, a happy happy Hebraic New Year I personally felt the shift massively I've been feeling so much lighter I've been feeling much more joy and I felt much more peace and I just pray the same over you and I just say stay stand firm stand firm do not give up do not give in I will keep saying this before the year is up before 2021 is up 
there will be a massive shift and a massive change. I just bless you and love you guys. Speak soon.